So, good morning. Welcome to another uh, lecture series on design and analysis of algorithm. Uh, in today's lecture, we are going to see about Enqueen's problem. Uh, so, I hope everyone is aware of uh, what Enqueen's problem is about. So, you will be given a chessboard. You have to place the queens in the chessboard. Uh, the condition to place the queens are that uh, no two queens can be placed on the same row, same column, same, di same diagonal. So, let us see how uh, the end queens problem will be solved using backtracking technique. So I hope uh, you know what is backtracking uh, technique. So by backtracking, if you encounter a dead end or if you encounter a state where you cannot proceed further, you will backtrack to the previous optimal state. So this is what backtracking is about. So if you are not getting an optimal solution, it is not like you will stop. So you will backtrack to the previous optimal state where you have got a solution and you will proceed from that state. So this is how backtracking works. And using backtracking, we are going to solve the end queen's problem. So so for backtracking, it is mandatory that we have construct a state space tree. So state space tree is a solution space that consists of nodes and edges. Uh, backtracking technique explodes the state space tree using a depth first search, whereas uh, branch and bound expands the tree using breadth first search. This is a major difference between uh, backtracking and branch and bound. So, by means of non promising nodes, it means uh, we cannot proceed further from that node. So, those nodes are called as non promising nodes. These nodes will not lead to a solution. So, those nodes will not be expanded further. So, consider an end. Uh, end queen problem. So the problem is to place end queens on an end cross end chessboard so that no two queens attack each other. So only the two queens will attack each other only if they are placed in two, same row or same column or same diagonal. So you should not place queen under such circumstances. So for example, uh, let us consider value for n which is 1, n equal to 1. So if it is one queen problem, the only one possibility is there. So which is called as the trivial solution. If n is equal to 2, you will take 2 cross 2 chessboard and there is no possibility for placing 2 queens at all. So for n equal to 2, uh, there is no solution. So n queen problem will not generate any sol solution. And for n equal to 3, also there is no solution because only 2 uh, queens can be placed without attacking each other. As you key, can see on the screen, only 2 queens can be placed on the chessboard without... Uh, uh, without going against the condition we have specified earlier. So for n equal to 3 also, we do not have any solution. So if we consider n equal to 4, consider 4 cross 4 chessboard, there are two possibilities of uh, placing all the four queens. These possibilities, uh, they look like the mirror image of each other. So n queen's problem can be defined as to place n queen on an n by n chessboard so that no two queens attack each other by being the same row or in same column or same diagonal. So initially we will start with an empty chessboard. So first queen can be placed in the first position which is first on the first box which is row equal to one and column equal to one. And uh, second queen uh, cannot be placed in the first column and similarly it cannot be placed in the second column because if we place in the first column it is like two queens are being placed in the same column and if it is placed in the same column, uh, they are they will be diagonally placed. So you cannot place in second column as well. So only possibility is you can either place in third or fourth. So here we are placing the second queen on the third column, which is second row and third column. And if you consider the third queen, so it cannot be uh, placed in uh, first column, but it can be placed in the second column. So the possibility is third row and second column, we are placing the third queen. But we do not have any possibility for placing the fourth queen because it doesn't satisfy any of the condition because it so we are backtracking to the previous state with this third column and we are trying to move the third queen so is there any possibility we can move the third queen absolutely no so again we have to backtrack to the second position or the position of second queen we cannot move second queen either because second queen has already reached the dead end so if a queen has reached the dead end we cannot move it any further so again, backtrack to the first queen position. So we have to move the first queen to the second slot. And again, the second queen is placed in the fourth position. Third queen is placed in the first position. Now fourth queen can be placed in the third position. So this is how uh, four cross four or four cross 
four queen problem is solved using backtracking technique. So this is a state um, state space tree for four cross four uh, four queens problem. Sorry, and similarly this is a state space tree for eight queens problem. So we can apply for any n values. I hope you understand this topic and thank you.